this is Preeti from Analytics India magazine. Welcome back to another episode from our segment Data Science as a Career. And in today's episode we will be talking about how to ace a data science interview. Having worked as a recruiter myself, let's go ahead and check out some of the insights we have to offer. Coming to the first tip, adequate research. To begin with, it is of the utmost importance to understand the designation and the job profile offered by the organization. The job profile might specify skills tools and techniques which help while preparing for an interview you get an idea about what the recruiter is actually looking for furthermore an employer will expect you to know something about the company and expect you to know why you will fit in well there you need to be prepared to answer the questions what do you know about our company and why do you want to work here before the interview review the company's website particularly their about us section also check out their linkedin facebook Twitter, Google Plus and other social pages to see what information the company is sharing. Review Glassdoor reviews, salaries and interviewing information. Don't be afraid to contact your prospective recruiter and ask them questions regarding the position that you will be interviewing for. If you don't know anything about the company or the position that you are applying for, it gives a very bad impression and might also be a red flag. Coming to the next point, creating a digital presence. Creating a strong digital presence is one of the first steps a candidate must take if he's applying for a job in data science. A LinkedIn profile which looks professional to the core should be maintained that specify work history with details about projects worked on. Up next, a GitHub account is a must to give the recruiter a first-hand look at projects and codes which is more convincing than anything else. Another place to create a strong presence is Quora. where a candidate can answer several questions related to data science and help people in need this way a recruiter can witness the knowledge a candidate holds in regard to data science or how the candidate analyzes the questions and answers them not to mention stake overflow is a good place to create an online presence since it is handcrafted for professional programmers to share questions and answers Also, doing a wide range of projects on Kaggle will demonstrate your capabilities in data science techniques. Moving on, a fine resume. I've already made a video on how to create a perfect resume. I'll drop the link in the description box below. Having said that, make sure to carry your well-formatted resume along with you. Some companies don't require it, but most still do. Don't make your recruiter print out one for you. I've judged every single candidate who's asked me to do that. Coming to the technical aspects, good knowledge of data science. As the interview gets going, the interview panel might call on a senior data scientist or a software engineer to assess your technical skills and abilities. A candidate should prepare about a variety of topics such as machine learning, deep learning, and conceptual questions about natural language processing. A lot of questions can be asked about programming along with problem solving questions related to the domain of the organization. This is where the research on the job description regarding the skills come in handy. Go through your resume and brush up on all the projects that you've done till date and all the skills and tools that you've used in them. Moving on, take the time to practice. Conduct practice interviews with a friend or family member and ask for their feedback. You can also record or videotape your responses so you can review your answers and check your body language. Let's look at some of the most commonly asked questions and how you should tackle them. Tell me about yourself. The worst way to approach this request is to tell them your life story, which is something they're definitely not interested in. The best way to approach this is to only discuss what your interests are related to the job and why your background makes you a great candidate. What are your strengths and weaknesses? It's easy to talk about your strengths, your detail oriented hard working a team player etc but always support these qualities with an example you cannot go up to an interview and say that i am a very hard working person without justifying it talking about the weaknesses a tip here is to never talk about a real weakness until it's something you've defeated coming to the next question walk me through your resume first of all you should already know everything on your resume including the timeline of your previous jobs If there is a gap for your resume, prepare well for explaining the gap but do not get defensive. Also when asked why you left the previous job, never badmouth the manager or the organization or their management style. It's a clear red flag. Moving on, always question the interviewer. 
Be ready to respond when you are asked if you have any questions for the interviewer. Prepare a list of questions you want to ask. Remember, you aren't simply trying to get the job. You are also interviewing the employer to assess whether the company and the position are a good fit for you. Coming to the last and the most important point, being culturally fit. In many companies, this is either a separate round or being culture fit is woven into all the rounds and all the interviews. You will be tested on this aspect the moment you enter the organization. On your interview evaluation sheet, there is always a separate section for behavior and being a good fit. It doesn't matter if you're good technically or have all the right skills if you aren't a team player or you get too defensive or offensive in an interview. So before you head for an interview, please be aware that you will be judged the minute you enter the offices. And with that, we come to the end of this video. Don't forget to subscribe to Analytics India magazine and follow this segment for everything related to data science as a career. See you soon. Bye.